we are starting our second phase of organic garden and because of high demand of organic food we've increased the fish tank to, to a tree so this is just the preliminary to show you how to prepare your fish tank the first thing we do is to paint it black or any dark color if you don't have a shed over your fish tank the proper thing to do is to paint it so that algae don't grow inside to make your water always dirty the second thing you need to do is that it has been i've not researched this but it has been proven over years that dry plantain leaves sucks out any any chemical that was in the container and also encourage the incub incubation of mosquito larva that's what tells you whether the the container is suitable for fish to survive if you see mosquito lava or any kind of lava at all survive in the water as we are preparing to introduce fish you know that yes that environment is comfortable for fish to survive now what we've done is we've increased the height of this tank there are going to be three tanks but we are going to pump the water out to the garden with just this one pump. So we are thinking, um, calculating, I'm, I'm thinking, how do I pump water out of the three tanks with just one pump to the farm? That's why we are elevating this one. We're going to elevate this one by the time we empty the water and disinfect it very importantly. After you've seen the lava, you've confirmed that the environment is okay for fish. You empty the water, you throw away the, the leaves, and you disinfect it with basically domestic salt. Salt you use in your kitchen. You use it to wash the inside of the container to disinfect it. The tank that will carry the pump will be in the middle. So I'm hoping that gravity will push water from here and from here to the middle tank and the pump will now pump it out to the farm. We'll keep you posted for you to see how our second season of organic garden is doing and how we are progressing. Thank you for watching. Please always subscribe, always share. Thank you very much.